Hello chess lovers, I have a very dramatic game for you. With the white pieces is playing Nigel Short and his opponent is Maya Chiburdanidze. The game was played in 1985 in Banja Luka. Short started with e4 and c5 by Chiburdanidze, Sicilian defense, knight f3, d6, d4 we see the open Sicilian, knight takes d4, knight f6, Knight c3, g6, Chiburdanidze is going for a dragon variation and bishop e2, short is going for the classical variation, bishop g7, we see castling by both sides, king h1, a prophylactic move, white is preparing f4, preventing any possible unpleasant checks from the g1, a7 diagonal, knight c6, knight b3, a6 and there it goes we see f4, b5, bishop f3 over protecting the pawn on e4, bishop d7, bishop e3, b4, knight a4, rook b8, stopping any possible intrusion by the knight, a3, a5, rook f2, queen c7 and rook d2, actually I like this rook maneuver very much, by bringing the rook on d file Nigel Short is starting to put pressure on d file and also he's planning to bring into life this e5 idea, knight d8, a takes b4, rook takes b4, knight c3, a4, now the knight on b3 is under attack and Nigel Short is counter attacking black knight by pushing the e pawn, d takes e5, f takes e5, queen takes e5, bishop d4, queen b8, Nigel short sacrificed the pawn but of course soon he will win back this vulnerable pawn on a4, knight c5, bishop b5, knight takes b5, queen takes b5, bishop e2, queen c6, c3 kicking away the rook and after rook b8 he captures on a4, queen c8, bishop e5, now the rook on b8 is under attack, but Chiburdanidze chose the best move and she played bishop h6 counter attacking white rook, of course if you play something like rook a8, then after bishop takes f6, bishop takes f6, white has a very dangerous move, knight d7, and if rook takes a4, simply queen takes a4, and how are you going to protect this rook? You can't place it on e8 because after knight takes f6 the rook is hanging, that's why Chiburdanidze made the best move she played bishop h6, bishop takes b8 and in return black is capturing on d2, queen takes d2, queen takes b8, bishop f3, queen b5, and we have reached the critical position, right now the knight on c5 is under attack and you can't move it away because you will lose your rook on a4 and also black has created a very dangerous threat which Nigel Short missed, in this position he played b4 not suspecting anything wrong, but this is a horrible blunder, and after b4 Chiburdanidze just played queen f1 and believe it or not but this is a checkmate, look at this, well after queen b5 Nigel Short could play queen f2 both covering the f1 square also protecting the knight, but instead we saw that horrible b4 move missing checkmate in one, this is what happens when you are looking at the wrong side of the board, it will be also very interesting to know your opinion about this game, waiting for your comments and questions, good luck.